morning YouTube. <sighs> so, I got my BS uh, battery monitor in. And I'm not impressed. Um, as I suspected, it's not going to work for what, what I wanted. Well, at least I don't think it is. The charge and discharge port is different. So the power is not actually going to run through it. I don't suspect. It didn't come with any instructions. I'll check this out for workmanship. It looks like some crap you get from Powerjack. So, email's been sent. I'm sending it back. I'm going to get my money back. I'm not going to use it. Um, so basically what I want from YouTube land is a recommendation on what I can get. Now they reckon this is 200 amps. I don't know about you guys, but I reckon, I'm just going to put it out there, if I threw 200 amps through that connection, I mean there's not even any build up on that board, look at that, it's dead flat. 200 amps is never going to travel through that. That's going to burn everything to the ground. So that crap is going back where it belongs and getting sent back to, you know, just left to China somewhere. And I'm going to start hunting around for a better one, maybe 250 amps, because that's not 200 amps. That wouldn't do 100 amps, I'm sorry. That's just going to burn up at 100 amps. So that's going back, and that's how it come out of interest. It come in that bag, sitting in that, sitting in a box that was crushed. No other foam, no other packing. It was sat on an angle to fit inside of a box, and the box was just crushed. So, that's going back, that's annoying. Batteries are getting there. We've got another four bags, or, two, or 800 of these clamp clips, um, 18650 holders. So that's all I need of them, don't need any more. A few more batteries coming this week. That is my update for now, YouTube. Thank you very much for watching, and I need feedback. What do I buy? Cheers.